John, still so many unanswered questions in this case, especially when you consider a key piece of geography. Now, this is the police holding cell where police officers say Raynette Turner became sick in her cell and ultimately died. But the hospital that the family believes could have saved her, it's located right there, directly across the street. Tonight, eight children are without a mother and a husband without closure. I want somebody to answer my questions. What happened to my wife? That's a hard thing to do. Just what happened to her. That's all I want to know. A husband overwhelmed by two powerful emotions, grief and anger. Herman Turner just lost the love of his life of 20 years, Raynette Turner. She died Monday inside a Mount Vernon police jail cell. I miss my wife. Mount Vernon police arrested Turner Saturday afternoon. She was held on a petty misdemeanor larceny charge, accused of stealing from a local restaurant wholesaler. With court closed on Sunday, Turner's arraignment was scheduled for Monday. And as she waited out the weekend in a jail cell. On Sunday, she was brought to the Mount Vernon Montefiore Hospital. She complained of illness. She was treated and released and brought back to the cell block. Turner never made her Monday court appearance. And she was going to be brought up to arraignment at 2 p.m. yesterday, and she was found to be uh, non responsive and uh, she had passed away. It actually appeared like she was, uh, she uh, died in her sleep. In the timeline they're giving for her passing, I was right upstairs. No one could have come up. Mr. Turner, can I talk to you for a moment, please? No, they said come back tomorrow morning. No one, my wife is dead downstairs. The Turners say Raynette was a loving wife and a dedicated mother. Eight children are involved. The children are old enough to understand, you know, um, as far as what's going on. And tonight, the family's attorney wants to know, did police do all they could to give Raynette Turner the medical attention she may have needed? There's a video monitor in the cell. And the question is, did they do anything or they did nothing? I want justice for my wife. John and Tamsin, State Attorney General Eric Schneiderman recently convened a special task force to look into police involved deaths here in New York State. That task force is here in Westchester looking into this case. One of the biggest pieces of evidence will be the medical examiner's report, which will have the exact cause of Turner's death. Reporting live in Mount Vernon tonight, Ayanna Harry, Pix 11 News.